welcome to this brief tutorial on how to create Sigma Nest parts as a Sigma Nest programmer. To start off, I will import a DXF file. This is our interactive mapping interface. Please check our YouTube short on the interactive mapping tutorial. Within part parameters, as a programmer, I make sure I've got a part name a number to nest, material, and thickness. Also ensure that the correct machine is selected. And you can set and select any secondary operations you have within your part data fields. For lead-ins and lead-outs, you select the type of lead-in and lead-out you want. Please use the sizes and leading radiuses that work best for your machine. After this, I will set the grain for my parts. The grain are the nesting parameters for each part. So I can add things like my part name for marking, or just simply as a label for me to identify at a later stage. And I have full control over the sizes and position of my marking. Next, I can set my grain for each part. This is at what increments my parts will be rotated when nesting. I can also add corner loops if needed. And that is a Sigmanist part. Thank you for watching. See you next time.